My name is Sharon. I grew up in London, but I moved to Middlesbrough a few years ago. Before I started coming to Kim, I went to school and went to college, kind of failed college. Um, <laughs> um, I did uh, some voluntary work with National Citizen Service. Um, we painted a fence and helped a food bank and that was pretty much it. But I was wanting something more that could give me more um, experience, something a bit more challenging. So I came to Kim hoping to find that. What made me keep coming to Kim was the computer facilities because my, at that time my laptop just kind of busted up and I was looking for a summer job. So computer facilities helped with that. So I was just basically just looking for jobs online the whole time. The job club as well helped. In terms of personal development, I feel like I've developed a lot. Um, I actually got a job here at Kim as business administration apprentice. I feel like I'm learning a lot and no day is ever the same. What's unique about Kim is we're a sort of, we're a one-stop shop. So you can come to us about anything. So whether it be about benefits advice or legal support or finding a job or finding an apprenticeship, or even just showcasing your talent. We have talent shows on all the time. So you could come to us about anything. Um, what we advertise we do is about 10% of what we actually help everyone with. I think that's what's unique. The livability course is a course mainly to help young people sort of know the life skills that they need to know when they move into their own accommodation. Um, away from the parents or the family home. It teaches things like how to shop and cook on a budget. We actually let the clients use the kitchens with, um, with the person delivering the session. The importance of the livability course for young people looking for housing is um, it gives them sort of extra, not extra points, but like um, up, on the Compass website when they're looking for housing. Um, if Aramis have seen that they have done the livability course, then it would sort of put them higher up on the list of priorities. <laughs>